Hey YouTube, what is going on? Brandon here with another video. Today we're going to be talking about the MacBook Pro, specifically about the uh, attachment that you can put on it, uh, the USB-C hub port. Uh, basically, this is going to allow you to connect USB, uh, SD cards, and also your charging uh, port is on this uh, extension as well. <clears throat> there will be a link to this product and the MacBook Pro as well as the printer that you see here um, in the description below. So make sure to check that out. All that information is down there for your convenience. And today we're going to be just printing a photo uh, via the USB uh, A to B cable that is going to be from the computer to the printer. Now without this port and without the USB A to B cable, this is not possible. Uh, but with these two uh, extra pieces, you are able to print regularly like you did before. For whatever reason, you don't want to print wirelessly, you wanted to print this way with the new MacBook Pro, it's going to be possible for you today. Again, there is a link in the description below for the MacBook Pro if you want to get your hands on one. Um, this is the best laptop I have owned by far. Okay, so we're getting right into it. You see that there's two ports there on the side of the uh, laptop. And uh, basically, you're just going to match them up with the one on the port. Sorry that it's, it gets a little blurry here, but doing the best I can with the camera. Uh, right when it's uh, lined up and you have it in there, then you're going to click it right into place. You see the blue light that comes right on. That means that it is attached. And you see there the different ports that you have. You even have a, a mini US, uh, SD slot there on the side. And you've got different uh, USB uh, uh, ports as well. So the one in the middle is the actual one that you're going to be able to slide your A to B cable into. Once that's connected, you can then connect the other side uh, to the printer. You probably are familiar with this cable here. It's the A to B USB cable, and uh, it's, it's an older cable that's been around for a while. So, so here, you're going to go right into your uh, system preferences, and the way to connect it is you're going to select printers and scanners, <clears throat> and it should come up right there as soon as you connect it via the uh, USB cable. Now, to be able to print, you're hitting Command and the P on this keyboard, and uh, any photo that you want that you have there on your desktop, as long as you select it and hit those two keys, uh, it will print right away. Uh, so it's really that easy. That's your photo there. That's what I wanted to print out, and um, that's basically it. Uh, from here, you can select that printer to print whatever it is that you want from your computer. If this is the setup that you wanted, I hope that this ended up helping you uh, achieve that setup. Um, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It would be greatly appreciated. Um, again, links in the description below for your convenience. Thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time. If you are having issues printing a certain color, you're not able to print at all, or your prints are coming out faded or choppy, the best printer's cleaning kit is the cleaning kit that will help you solve this problem inexpensively. Um, go ahead and order yours. There's a link in the description below. Best printer's cleaning kit. Also, there are multiple videos on this channel showing you how to use this product. Uh, so if you're having this particular issue, go ahead, link in the description below. Go ahead and get yours.